Hello people, Matrix are here. Welcome to part one of adding music to maps. You're going to need uh, two things uh, to do this. One is a piece of software to convert MP3 to OGG. I use FreeRip. And the other thing is a, a hosting account I use Folding. Links to both of these can be found on our website www.dumpserver.co.uk Right, first things first, let's go ahead and rip an MP3. So here's my software here. Free rip. I'm going to tell it that I want to do some converting, so I click here, change that to convert. Here's my MP3 here, it's an MP3 by Sam Sparrow, black and gold. So I'm going to drag that across. That's done. And then I'm going to go up the top to the rip menu and then choose convert selected track to Vorbis. That's now going to convert that to an OG format, which it's now doing. It's already placed the icon on the desktop up here. But you wait for that process to complete. That's now done. I can close that, dismiss that, get rid of that. So there we go. There is the Sam Sparrow OG file. I'm now going to delete that old MP3. Okay, next thing you need to do is now convert this OG to MUX. I call it MUX, to MUX format. Okay, and to do this, you need to start Track Mania. Oh, already got a copy running. Let's just quit out of that. Okay, you need to start Track Mania, and then on your menu, there's a place here conf uh, configure. Click that. Sorry, wrong one. <laughs> there's a menu called Help. Click that, and then it's got custom data. Okay, click that. And then another one here on menu down the bottom it's got convert music. Click that. Now search for that OG file which will be on my desktop. There it is. Open that. This card comes up and it says your music has been successfully converted to MUX. Done. Okay, okay. Right, we can exit that. If I now go into my documents, Trackmania, Challenge Music, it's now stuck that Sam Sparrow MUX file in there. So I've now got a MUX file to work with. The OG file can now be deleted. Okay, I'm now going to go to File Den. And I'm going to upload that MUX file to file them. Okay, that one there. So I'll just put, say upload. If you haven't got a folding account, it's a free account, so just get yourself one. It doesn't cost anything. Down to here, upload file. So I need to browse for a file. Go to my documents, Trapmania, and music, and there's the MUX file. Upload that. This file is 1.4 meg. It won't take too long. Nearly there. That's done. Right, now the important bit. You now need to take a link away from file hosting and here it says direct URLs you press that and there is the direct link for that file I'm going to control C on my keyboard to copy it now close that okay I'm now going to go to my documents I'm going to track mania and challenge music okay and I'm going to make a new um, text document. Okay, and now I'm going to control V and paste 
that link into the text document okay and now down to file and save as the save type change to all files okay and now I need to name it I need to name it exactly the same as the mux file but with a lock ending so this thing would be Sam Sam Sparrow dot mux dot lock save get out there and there is my lock file okay there it is there's a link in it sam space sparrow dot mux dot lock there's a mux file there right now this is the important bit this is what's going to make sure that your music music is working okay i haven't added this to a map yet I'm now going to delete that mux file from my computer. That's now gone. The only thing I've now got left on my computer is this mux file, this lock file. All it is is a reference to where that mux file is located on Folder. So now when I go to my map and I add this music, all my map can do is read this lock file and download it from that location. So if it doesn't work when I validate my map, it isn't going to work online. This proves that your music will work. You don't have to worry about it. If it works when you validate it, it's definitely going to work online. That's my first part of uh, adding music. Hope you enjoyed it. Please join me for part two.